Okay, so for this first method, you're just going to need some eyebrow stencils. And this is going to help you create your eyeliner shape. And basically, you just take your eyebrow stencils and then cut off the big part of the eyebrow. Then what you have left over, you just create your eyeliner shape. And I just did this kind of roughly because I already have mine done. have eyebrow stencils, I thought of another way that you can do. So basically, just Google eyeliner shapes and then find one that you like. Once you found that, you save it to your downloads or wherever you want to save it. Then bring it up onto a Word document, right? That's what it's called. And then just crop it to your eye size, basically. And then you can print it out and then cut it out and just use that. So back to the eyebrow stencils. You're just going to take this and you're going to press it onto your skin. And it's going to stink a little. No, I always say dumb stuff. It's going to stick a little because it is plastic. So yeah, you just take your favorite eyeliner and then just begin filling it in. And you know, you'll have your wing nice and shaped. And, but you're going to have to work on the front of the eyeliner a little bit because the stencil is not big enough for the whole eye. Or I mean, you could do that. But anyways, um, you're going to have to try to work on the other part by yourself and... Since it was on camera, it was a little bit terrible, so I fixed it up, and this is what you see. So on to the second method. I find this one to be the easiest because, I don't know, it's just find it the easiest. So you take a piece of tape and you rip it off. Then you place that which way you want your wing to be, and this is just going to create a nice line, so that way it'll be nice and clean, and you'll just have your little nice fold for your wing, basically. I don't know, I don't know how to explain this creates a really nice line so once you're done you can just rip the piece of tape off and it'll be nice and clean to the q-tip so this one I find to be the hardest method but basically you just need a q-tip and then you place it on your eye also creating that kind of angle but I find it harder to use than tape since it comes up a little bit but with this one you can kind of just use that the other end of the q-tip to clean it up so yeah now on to seriously the best method ever so for this one you're basically just gonna freehand it and hope for the best so thank you guys for watching as always and I hope you have a wonderful day